and Tom's will begin by taking you through some of the newest features in Distribution Engine. So over to you, Tom's. Thank you, thank you. Hello, hello, everyone. So what have we added for you in this release? Uh, first off, we're excited to share with you our latest improvements to the performance page. We know that every organization has its unique metrics that define success. So you can now create custom metrics based on the available data in your org to monitor your team's performance. Uh, that way you can make data-driven decisions and tailor your performance-driven routing. Next, we're introducing personas. That's for custom permissions. Managing who can see and do what in DE can be challenging with just one set of custom permissions. Personas allow you to configure multiple sets of custom permissions with different levels of access and assign them to your team managers as appropriate for their role in your organization. We've also improved our export import feature. There are times when you need to make changes and test your configuration in a sandbox or other lower environment, and then move your configuration over to production. In addition to being able to move your teams and tag collections between environments, you can now migrate your territory maps. Finally, we have made several other changes and additions, such as the classifier can now be invoked via API, and we have further improved the test tool and assignment simulator to improve accuracy. And you now have more configurable options for cap behavior when using them together with sticky assignment. We've introduced a distributor delay feature, and we've also optimized uh, the screen width usage for larger displays. 